For more stock news updates, remember to press the like button and subscribe. With that being said, let's get straight into the video. Palantir Technologies and Microsoft have experienced contrasting performances in the stock market throughout 2024. Palantir has seen substantial gains, while Microsoft has delivered a more lackluster performance. To be precise, Palantir's stock price has surged by 75% this year. On the other hand, Microsoft's stock has increased by just 8% in the same period, with shares pulling back in the past month despite a strong showing in the first half of the year. Both companies have been leveraging artificial intelligence to fuel their growth. The positive news is that both Palantir and Microsoft have seen a boost in their business operations due to the increasing adoption of this transformative technology. Palantir Technologies is assisting governments and enterprises through its artificial intelligence platform. This platform has gained significant traction among customers, as evidenced by the sharp acceleration in Palantir's growth in the second quarter of 2024. The company reported a revenue increase of 27% year-over-year to $678 million, an improvement from the 21% year-over-year growth in the previous quarter. Further analysis of other revenue-related metrics suggests that Palantir's growth rate may continue to improve in upcoming quarters. For instance, Palantir's remaining deal value increased by 26% year-over-year in the second quarter to $4.3 billion. This metric reflects the total value of Palantir's contracts yet to be fulfilled at at the end of a period. The robust growth in remaining a deal value closely aligning with Palantir's revenue growth indicates the increasing adoption of its software platforms. Additionally, Palantir saw a significant expansion in its customer base during the last quarter. The company's total customer count rose by 41% year over year in the second quarter to 593. Furthermore, Palantir's customers have been committing to larger deals. In the previous quarter, Palantir closed 96 deals valued at a minimum of $1 million. Among these, 33 deals were worth $5 million or more, and 27 deals exceeded $10 million. In comparison, during the same period last year, Palantir secured 66 deals worth $1 million or more, 18 of which were valued at $10 million or more, while 30 were worth over $5 million. The increase in deal sizes last quarter, coupled with a growing customer base, underscores the pivotal role of artificial intelligence in Palantir's strong performance. Management highlighted on the most recent earnings call that one of the most significant indicators of their success is the number of existing customers signing expansion agreements, many of which are a direct result of the artificial intelligence platform. Looking forward, Palantir is optimistic about acquiring new customers and expanding existing engagements as they focus on guiding customers from the prototype type phase to full-scale production. Management shared multiple examples during the earnings call of how they are helping enterprises deploy the artificial intelligence platform to achieve tangible results. This trend is expected to continue, especially as the market for generative artificial intelligence software is projected to grow at an annual rate of 58% through 2028, potentially generating $52 billion in annual revenue by the end of the forecast period. Given this significant market opportunity, Palantir is well positioned for long-term growth. The company expects to achieve $2.75 billion in revenue in 2024, representing a 23% increase from the previous year. The company's improving revenue pipeline suggests that Palantir is on track to capitalize on the substantial opportunity within the artificial intelligence software market, making it a strong contender as a top artificial intelligence stock in the long run. In contrast, Microsoft has been a leader in the field of artificial intelligence, partly due to its partnership with ChatGPT developers for OpenAI. The stock has experienced a 12% decline in the past month, despite the company reporting better-than-expected results for the fourth quarter of fiscal 2024, which concluded on June 30th. Microsoft's revenue grew by 15% year-over-year to $64.7 billion, while earnings increased by 10% to $2.95 per share. Analysts had expected $2.93 per share in earnings on revenue of $64.4 billion. The company's intelligent cloud business saw a 19% revenue increase last quarter, reaching $28.5 billion. Within this segment, Microsoft's Azure Cloud Services division achieved a 21% year-over-year -year growth. Microsoft CEO Satya Nadella noted on the recent earnings call that the company ended the quarter with over 60,000 customers utilizing its Azure Artificial Intelligence Services, marking a nearly 60% increase from the same period last year. Additionally, Nadella mentioned that the average spending per customer on Azure Artificial Intelligence Services is rising. Investors should also note that Microsoft is the second largest player in the cloud infrastructure market, trailing only Amazon, which holds a 32% market share. 
However, Microsoft has been steadily gaining ground on Amazon in this market, as the market for artificial intelligence services in the cloud is expected to grow at an annual rate of nearly 31% through 2030, potentially generating close to $398 billion in annual revenue by the end of the forecast period, Microsoft is poised for significant growth. Therefore, investors should consider the broader picture, as Microsoft's increasing influence in the cloud computing market, driven by artificial intelligence, could provide a substantial boost to to its business in the long term. Currently, Palantir is growing at a faster pace than Microsoft, which may attract investors seeking a rapidly expanding artificial intelligence stock. However, investors should be aware that Palantir is trading at a premium with a price-to-sales ratio of 29. In contrast, Microsoft is relatively more affordable with a price-to-sales ratio of 12. Additionally, the chart above indicates that Palantir's earnings are expected to grow at a much faster rate, given the significant gap between its trailing and forward earnings. Meanwhile, Microsoft's earnings are projected to grow at a slower pace. Specifically, consensus estimates suggest that Palantir's earnings will increase at an annual rate of 85% over the next five years, significantly outpacing Microsoft's projected growth of 15%. Ultimately, the choice between these two artificial intelligence stocks comes down to investors' risk tolerance. Those willing to pay a premium for a fast-growing company might consider investing in Palantir, while Microsoft may be a better option for investors seeking a stock that is reasonably priced yet capable of delivering steady growth over the long term. In the end, Palantir Technologies and Microsoft have experienced different fortunes in the stock market this year, with Palantir seeing substantial gains and Microsoft showing more modest growth. Both companies are leveraging artificial intelligence to drive growth, with Palantir experiencing faster revenue increases and expanding its customer base. Microsoft, while not growing as quickly, remains a strong player in the cloud computing market, benefiting from its artificial intelligence services. For more stock news updates, remember to press the like button and subscribe. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.